Hi, we're going to start with doing some adding of phonemes, then we're going to take some away. That means I'm going to say a word and ask you to add a sound to it first. So let's try that. You're good at this. You'll know how to do it. Say it. Yes, it. Add f to the beginning. The new word is yes, fit. Say on. Add er to the beginning. Yes, Ron. Say an. Add p to the beginning. Yes, the new word is pan. Say ip. Add h to the beginning. Yes, the new word is hip. Say at. Add m to the beginning. Yes, the new word is mat. Now let's take away a sound. Say rim without er. Yes, m. Say dull without d. Yes, all. Say bag without b. Yes, ag. Say will without woo. Yes, ill. Say lamb without ul. Yes, am. Good work. Up next, let's practice all of our capital letters and the sound they make. First letter, X, X, L, ul, Y, Y, Z, Z, H, T, T, D, D, I, I, A, A, R, R, K, K, W, W, O, O, A, N, N, Q, Q, C, G, G, U, A, E, A, B, B, S, S, J, J, F, F, V, V. Whoa, he's upside down sideways. There we go. P, M, M. Last, I'm going to do some writing on the board and I'll be ready to listen to you do some blending. First word, sound, yes, z, sound, yes, ah, sound, yes, g, blend, zag, Zag. Next word. Sound. Yes. Z. Sound. Yes. I. Sound. Yes. G. Blend. Zig. Zig. Sometimes we hear people say zigzag. Those are those two words together. One more. Sound. Z sound, yes, I sound, yes, p blend, zip, zip. Here comes a sentence, starting with a capital. First sound, yes, k, sound, yes, a, sound, Yes, mm. before my next word, what do I need? Yes, a finger space. Next word has a capital. That means it's going to be a name. Sound, mm. sound, yes, ah, uh. sound, yes, all, uh. blend, vowel, vowel. 
So we have a person in our sentence. Their name is Val. Can Val. Finger space before the next word. Sound. Yes. Z. Sound. Yes. I. Sound. Yes. P. Blend. Zip. Zip. Read our sentence so far. Can thou zip? I'm running out of room, so I'm going to go to the next line. And here comes my last word. Sound. Yes, I. Sound. Yes, t. Blend. It. It. Let's read our sentence and see what we need at the end of this one. Can thou zip it? Hmm, it doesn't sound like we need a period. It sounds like it's asking a question. Can thou zip it? We need a question mark at the end of that sentence to show we're done asking a question. Can thou zip it? Maybe she's getting ready to go outside and needs her coat zipped. Hope you're having some time outside with your family. Take care.